we will start reading Chaitanya Charitamrita, Madhjalila 8, text 88. So it's about the talks between Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Ramananda Roy. <laughs> so Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, you translate in Bhakti. You sit in Bhakti. This is translating. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is asking Ramananda Roy about spiritual life, how to come to self realization, and similar topics. <clears throat> so now Chila Ramananda Roy is answering after the last question. The complete attainment of the lotus feet of Lord Krishna is made possible by love of Godhead. Specifically, Madhurya Rasa or conjugal love. Lord Krishna is indeed captivated by this standard of love. Lord Krishna? Lord Krishna is indeed captivated by this standard of love. Padi Purna Krishna Prapti E Prema Hoite E Brahmara Vasha Krishna Kahe Bhagavate. If we see word by word, we can see that Haripurna means completely full. Krishna Prapti, achievement of the lotus feet of Lord Krishna. So, Gurudev, maybe you can say something about the standard of law. Okay. So, purport to explain the topmost quality of conjugal law. Conjugal law. Srila Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami. This is the author of Chaitanya Charita Amrita. He gives the example of the material elements, the sky, the air, the fire, the water, and the earth. In the sky, space, there is the quality of sound. Similarly, in the air, there are the qualities of sound and touch. In fire, there are three qualities, sound, touch, and form. In water, there are four qualities, sound, touch, form, and taste.
So finally, in earth, they are all five qualities. Sound, touch, form, taste, and also smell. It is our body. This is my art. So, the five elements, sound, touch, form, taste, smell. This is the things we are actually, through our senses, we, we can actually run in and first talk. Run in. Feel or smell or like through the senses. So the same, the same can be applied to the rasa, which is known as Madhurya rasa. Or conjugal law. In conjugal law, there are the qualities of neutrality, servitorship, fraternity, paternity, as well as conjugal love itself. The conclusion is that true conjugal love, the Lord is completely satisfied. Otherwise, it's not complete. Because all these five elements coming in. It, it, it would be like if, if if I have a lover and let's say the motherly love is missing, no, then it's not complete, right? No motherly love is there. When not, we <coughs> love is sick and not healthy, it is a motherly love. You cannot eat it. Yeah. You can eat it. And hatred is also there. Mr. when she become angry, she becomes very nervous. She don't want to see blue. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and when friendly love is there, motherly love is there. So all the sad comes to the so only this complete love can satisfy. Conjugal love, Madhurya Rasa, is also known as Shringara Rasa. Guru, do you want to explain? It is the conclusion of Srimad Bhagavatam that in the complete combination of loving service to the Lord, namely in conjugal love, 
the Supreme Lord fully agrees to be under the control of the devotee. The highest form of conjugal love is represented by Therefore, in the past times of Radha and Krishna, we can see that Krishna is always subjugated by Srimati Radharani's influence. Jai Shri Radha. Her love is always winning in every game, in every in every lila. Her love is succeeding always. Like in Radakum. He showed that she lose, but she did it that same. So in bathing Lila, it looks like Krishna wins. But actually, from the eyes of the Manjari, of course, Radharani wins. And this is not just because they are blind by love. There's a reason why it is. <laughs> Very deep reason. So it's the truth, the absolute truth, that she is always winning. Jai Shri Radha. Mai Bhakti Hi Bhutanam Amrit Advaya Kalpate Dishayat as in Matsneho. Bhavatina mat apanaha. The Lord told the gopis the means of attaining my favor is loving service unto me. And fortunately, you are all thus engaged. Those living beings who render service unto me are eligible to be transferred to the spiritual world and attain eternal life with knowledge and bliss. So Prabhupada is writing here, the aim of human life is to attain the natural position of eternal life. And our natural position in eternal life, Prabhupada is giving on the last page of Bhagavad Gita, last sentence. Hmm? What 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 is writing? Uh, no more position in pleasure giving process. Our natural position. <laughs> Thus, he attains his normal condition in the pleasure giving potency. 
And who is that pleasure giving potency? Sri Mati Radharam, our son. Jai Sri Radharam. It seems Prabhupada. It's in the beauty of Prabhupada that no need to plus add anything. Only read that. If you understand. Second thing, similarly, it's a position of the book of Ananda. You don't need to add any words. Same, only two words to others. What we do? We memorize Hindi words. That meaning is not clear to me. We have to understand in English the words. Because understanding is important. Your language you understand and your meaning clear So Krishna Das Kavaraj Goswami is giving now a verse from Bhagavad Gita. Ye yatta mam prapatyante tungstataiva bhajami aham. Wow. Mam avart manu vartante manusya parta sarva shaha. According to Lord Krishna in Bhagavad Gita 4.11, all of them as they surrender unto me, I reward accordingly. I think this is very natural, even we are doing like this, right? If somebody is very shy coming to you, then you are very softly trying to open him. Somebody is rushing in, aggressive, you try to, you know, please, please uh, sit down. <laughs> be peaceful and like this. So according how the person is coming to you, you are also react, reacting, right? So Krishna is doing the same. If you want something from him, you can make business with him, no problem. I will serve you, but you know, I have some wishes. Krishna says, okay, no problem. Condition is there. You are moved, but you are conditioned. He is yeah. also conditioned. Uh, yeah, he gives that condition that you have to start. Yes, also. You have to go first to him. Uh, yes. You have to walk yourself for eight times. Then he will come. 16 so that means you come and want to make a business. So he's saying, okay, then let's let us do a business mm. according your wish. Mm. What you like? What you like? If you like me, I will do also for you. No problem. Then you may say later on, no, I don't want to make business, you know, because I love you. But still, there's something in the heart. So it may, may be mixed. There's love, bhakti, but there's also mishra. It's mixed. Still some little wishes, little conditions. Okay, no problem. Krishna, accordingly to your wish, will answer. No problem. But how is Radharani? No, but what is writing? I had pronounced it. What about Radharani? What Prabhupada is telling was <laughs> But this example with the pot, I love so much. Please, Guru Dev. No. No? Okay. No, I don't know how to have to I'm interested to listen to <laughs> So, 
I reward accordingly. Everyone, everyone follows my path in all respects. This is a very interesting point, actually, right? Everyone is already on the path. They may know or not. That means wherever you are in whatever consciousness, you are used in a very big lila, so to say. Even in the material world, we are cleaning each other, we are like this. So we are all, all actually included in this love. This is Radharani's law, and it's perfect. No one is lost. Even the worst person is not lost. That's Radharani's mercy. E premara anurupa na pare bhachite in Srimad Bhagavatam 10, 32-22, it is said, Lord Krishna cannot proportionally reciprocate devotional service in the Madhuyaras. So if you want to come in Madhuya, you have to give yourself complete sign. The Guru say always, you have to sign contract. I give myself. Madhuya Ras is the sweet Rasta. The sweet loving love very important not only in Hindi you have to say in English because many are new to understand so if I do any mistake and running so please stop me and ask please always it's open to us interrupt no problem the last sentence is also in Russian. So in Srimad Bhagavatam, it is said that Lord Krishna cannot proportionately like. You cut something, it's not the whole, it's just a part of it. Reciprocate devotional service in the Madhuyaras. Proportion means the, the gopis are giving something and he cannot give the this amount back. <laughs> I said, and Prabhupada will explain you. He will explain so beautifully. You see that. Oh, he's that. There's no commentary right now. No, no, commentary will come. It, it, it will come. Go on. Yes. yes. Not right. Only read the line by line. This is very important. So he is indebted. Therefore, he always remains a debtor to such devotees.
text 93, when the gopis were overwhelmed with this satisfaction due to Lord Krishna's absence from the Rasa Lila, Krishna returned to them and told them, My dear gopis, our meeting is certainly free from all material contamination. I must admit that in many lives, it would be impossible for me to repay my debt to you because you have cut off the bondage of family life just to search for me. Consequently, I am unable to repay you. Therefore, please be satisfied with your honest activities in this regard. Yadyapi Krishna Saundhaya Madhurya Radhuya Racha Devira Sangi Tandra Vada Yema Durya. Although Krishna's unparalleled beauty is the top most sweetness of love of Godhead, his sweetness increases unlimitedly when he is in the company of the gopis. We may consider a special gopi in this. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Consequently, Krishna exchanges of love with the gopis is the topmost perfection of love of Godhead. Top but I can't. <laughs> yes. Purport of Srila Prabhupada, Krishna and his devotees become perfectly intimate in conjugal love of God. This word intimate is in faith. And you see here, and you see the last In other mellows, the Lord and the devotees do it's not. In other mellows, the Lord and the devotees do not enjoy transcendental bliss as perfectly. The next verse from Srimad Bhagavatam will illustrate this verse. Tatra ti shu shubhe dhavir bhagavan deva ki suktaha maji manina hai manam maha marakatoya. Although the son of Devaki 
the Supreme Personality of Godhead is also the reservoir of all kinds of beauty when he is among the gopis he nonetheless become more beautiful for he resembles a marakata jewel surrounded by gold and other jewels Prabhu kahe e satyavati sumi jaya kripa kari kaha yati age kichu hoya Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu replied this is certainly the limit of perfection but please be merciful to me and speak more if there is more Roy Kahe Ihara Age Puche Yena Jane Eta Dina Nahijani Ajay Gurani Roy Ramananda replied Until this day I did not know anyone within this material world who could inquire beyond this perfectional stage of devotional service. In Hara Mahaje Radhara Brema Satya Shiromani Yanhara Mahima Sarva Shastrete Vakami. Among the loving affairs of the gopis, Ramananda Roy continued, the love of Sri Mati Radharani for Sri Krishna is topmost. Indeed, the glories of Srimati Radharani are highly estimated in all revealed scriptures. See that. See that. So party. Jaiho. Yatharatha Priya Vishnus. Dasya Kundambriyam Tata Sarva Gopishu Saivaka Vishnu Antya Vallava. Just as Srimati Radharani is most dear to Sri Krishna, her bathing place, known as Radhakund, is also dear to him. Among all the gopis, Srimati Radharani is supermost and very dear to Lord Krishna. Anaya Radito Nunam Bhagavan Hariya Ishwarana Yamno Vihaya Govinda Ritoyam Anayapraha. When the gopis began to talk among themselves, they said, Dear friends, the gopi who has been taken away by Krishna to a secluded place 
must have worshipped the Lord more than anyone else. Purport by Srila Prabhupada, the name Rata is derived from this verse. From the word Anayaraditaha, meaning by her the Lord is worshipped. Sometimes the critics of Srimad Bhagavatam find it difficult to find Radharani's holy name. But the secret is disclosed here in the word Aradhitaha, from which the word Radha has come. Of course, the name of Radharani is directly mentioned in other Puranas. This Gopi's worship of Christ, and therefore her name is Radha, or the topmost worshipper. Rabu Kahe Age Kaha Sunite Paisuke Apu Amritanadi Vahetu Maramuke. Lord Sri Chitana Mahaprabhu said, Please speak on. I'm very happy to hear you because a river of unprecedented nectar is flowing from your mouth. Churi Kari Raja Kenila Gopi Ganera Dare. Anya Peksha Hoyle Primera Kandata Maskuri. During the Rasa dance, Sri Krishna did not exchange loving affairs with Srimati Radharani due to the presence of other gopis. Because of the dependence of the others, the in intensity of love between Radha and Krishna was not manifest. Therefore, he stole her away. Srila Prabhupada is writing in his purport, out of fear of the other gopis, Lord Sri Krishna took Srimati Radharani to a secluded place. In this regard, the verse Kamsari Abhi, the following verse 106, will be quoted from the Gita Govinda of Jayadev Goswami. Radha Lakti Gopire Yati Shakshakkare Jaga Thabe Jani Radhaya Krishnera Ghada Anuraga. If Lord Krishna rejected the company of the other gopis for Srimati Radharani, we can understand that Lord Sri Krishna has intense affection for her. Rai Kahe Tape Shuna Primera Mahima Trichakate Rata Primera Nahike Upama Ramananda Roy continued Please therefore hear from me about the 
glories of Srimati Radharani's loving affairs. They are beyond compare within these three worlds. Gopi Ganera Rasa Nitte Mandali Chadiya Rata Chahi Bhane Pire Vila Kariya Finding herself treated equally with all the other gopis, Srimati Radharani displayed her tricky behavior and left the circle of rasa dance. Missing Srimati Radharani's presence, Krishna became very unhappy and began to lament and wandered throughout the forest to search her out. Text one hundred and six. Kamsari api samsara vasana bhata shrinka shrinkalam ratam adhaya ridhaya tadyaja vraja sundari. Lord Krishna, the enemy of Kamsa. took Sri Mati Ratarani within his heart, for he desired to dance with her. Thus he left the area of the Rasa dance and the company of all other Beautiful damsels of branch. One hundred seven. Being afflicted by the arrow of Cupid and unhappily regretting his mistreating Radharani, Madhava, Lord Krishna began to search for Srimati Radharani along the banks of the Yamuna River. <clears throat> when he failed to find her, he entered the bushes of Brindavan and began to lament. Uh -huh. Text one hundred and eight. A Duish Lokera Arta Vicha Rila Jani Vicharit Ute Yena Amritera Kani. Simply by considering these two verses, one can understand what nectar there is in such dealings. It is exactly like freeing a mind of nectar. Yeah. 
सप्तकोटि गोपी संगे रासविलास एक मूर्खे राहे राधा पाश कृष्ण वॉज इन दिट्स ऑफ हंड्रेड्स ऑफ थाउजेंड्स ऑफ गोपीस ड्यूरिंग द रास he still kept himself in one of his transcendental forms by the side of shrimati bhagavan sattarana preme dekhi sarvatra samata prathara kutila prem bhaila pama Lord Krishna is equal to everyone in his general dealings but due to the conflicting ecstatic love of Shrimati Radharani there were opposing elements text 111 the progress of loving affairs between young couples is like the movement of a snake on account of this two types of anger arise between young couples anger with cause and anger without cause for for pashila prabhu during the rasa dance one form of krishna was between every two gopis however by the side of shrimati radharani there was only one krishna this is my of although this was the case shrimati radharani still manifested this agreement with krishna This verse is from the Uchvala Nilamani, Shringara Veda Katan, one hundred and two, written by Sri the Rupa of Swami. So, could you could you could you explain? Could you explain? It? But the side of Sri Matanala, there there was only one Krishna. This is could you explain? This is Manjari Baba. This is the Manjari Baba. Oh. Prabhupada is looking only one Krishna. So he here is a Brajendranantha. Manjiri see Brajendranthan here, or Gopi see Devaki Nanda, Jasoda Nanda, because we see both sides, two sides. <laughs> Everywhere, Krishna. So this is exp- is a Narayan Krishna, Vishnu Krishna. He expands them, but then Nanda nothing. He is always side with Radha, and his desire then his expansion goes there. And Manjiri is looking this. So Prabhupada eyes also looking, and he gives this. Which number page is this? Very useful. Underline, yeah. That is the problem. I don't like this without underlining word. You cannot find it again. Yes. Huh? What? What page? 
Text 111. Text 111. This book, page number 161. This is the one hundred eleven. This book, page number one hundred sixty one. This is the one hundred eleven. This book, page number one hundred sixty one. So yes, he 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 make the purpose of that. This parampara he made. Sorry. So I never add any word, any thing in Prabhupada's books, and I never talk in the books of Anandas Baba. No, I do some like that. And nothing to add in hidden path of devotion of Nara and Mara. Only try to understand it. But you have to know why he writes one Krishna and two Krishna. <laughs> <laughs> Krishna is one. Rajendandan and two Krishna is the pillar. Understand? Two Krishna, man. You see. Right, one Krishna and two Krishna. One Krishna was between two gopis. Ah, yes. So it's just a half Krishna. <laughs> yeah. Because so it's not full. It's not the Chandanandana. <laughs> what is that? What I have to understand. <laughs> Prabhupada understand, and he explained it. So he to write purpose. Text one hundred and twelve. Rota kari ra sachati kela mani kari tanri na dekhiya kya kula hoy lakshmi hari. When Radharani, out of anger and resentment, left the Rasa dance, Lord Sri Krishna, not seeing her, became very anxious. Samyak Saravasana Krishna Rasalila. Rasalila Vasanate Radhika Shrinkala. Lord Krishna desires, no, Lord Krishna's desire in the Rasalila circle is perfectly complete. But Srimati Radharani is the binding link. In that desire, wow. Tanhavinu rasalila na hi bhaya chitte mandali chadiya gela ratha anvesite. The rasa dance does not shine in the heart of Krishna without 
Srimati Radharani. Therefore, he also gave up the circle of the Rasa dance and went out to search for her. Itastata Brahmi Kahan Radha Mopana Visada Karine Kamavane Kinahana. When Krishna went out to search for Srimati Radharani, he wondered here and there. However, not finding her, he became afflicted by the arrow of Cupid and began to lament. Since Krishna's lusty desires were not satisfied even in the midst of hundreds of thousands of gopis, He was thus searching after Srimati Radharani. We can easily imagine how transcendentally qualified she is. Transcendentally qualified. Text 117, Brabukahe, ye lagi ailama tomasthane, se sabatatka vastu hoila mera kyane. After hearing this, Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said to Ramananda Roy, that for which I have come to your residence, has now become an object of truth in my knowledge. Ebese janilun satya sadhana nyanaya age ara ache kichu sunite manahaya. Now I have come to understand the sublime goal of life and the process of achieving it. Nevertheless, I think that there's something more ahead. Now, this line has to be What is the sublime? Sublime means? Now I have come to understand the sublime goal of life. No, no. Yeah, in that lens. What is sublime goal? The word sublime means something like the top or highest. The highest. Mm -hmm. The topmost. The highest goal of life. So there are different goals in life, but the highest goal of life. So before conjugal love is the highest. Highest, they say. But uh, among con conjugal love, Radharani's love, Radharani's glory is topmost. This this therefore this is say. Sublime goal of life. Sublime goal of life is brain prayer. Mm. That is sublime goal of life. That highest thing to be made, to think and see, that is sublime goal of life. 
and that is Radha Dasi can see that. Other will not see. Only Prabhupada can see that. There is some comments of Prabhupada is there? Not here. Yes. Yeah. to meditate in this highest thing. That where is the Brajanda Nandan? And where is the Nandan? And who can see the Brajanda Nandan? And where is Brajanda Nandan is standing? There. Yeah. <laughs> Many things I know, but I know meditate here, then we not know sublime goal of life. Rade, rade. <laughs> now I have come to understand the sublime goal of life and the process of achieving it. Ah, that's the process of achieving it. Sarup and Sarup Siddhi. And he writes the word this, Sarup and Sarup Siddhi. On page four. Already. Page four. And many times, Understand the meaning comes with that. Who will understand? They will do it. And who no understand for them, no need to make purpose or something, they will never understand. Without Sarup and achieving is only possible with your Sarup. And perfection of that self. Underline this. Which number is text this? 118. Eight. 18. 118. 118. 16 yes. to 18. Ah, yes, I did. Understand? Nevertheless, I think that there's something more ahead. And my mind is desiring to have it. When you achieve this, then desire will come from that. Now you will like this very much. Krishnera Swarupa Kahe Radhara Swarupa Rasa Kantatva Prema Kantatva Rupa. Kindly explain the transcendental features of Krishna and Srimati Radharani. Also explain the truth of transcendental mellow and the transcendental form of love of God. Kripa kari e tatva tahata amare tomarina keha iha nirupite nare. Kindly explain all this truth to me, but for yourself, no one can ascertain them. But 
রয় কাহে ইহা আমি কিছুই নাই জানি তুমি এ খাও তুমি এ খাও সে কাহি আমি মানি শ্রী রামানন্দ রয় রিপ্লাইড আই ডু নট নো এনিথিং অ্যাবাউট দিস I simply vibrate the sound you make me speak. Tumara shikshaya bhadi yena shukha pata shakshat ishvara tumi thibu chitumara nata I simply repeat like a parrot whatever instructions you have given me you are the supreme personality of god had himself who can understand your dramatic performances Udaye brerana kara jivaya kahao vani ki kahi he bhala manda ki chui na jani You inspire me within the heart and make me speak with a thank you I do not know whether i am speaking well or badly prabhu kahe maya vadi amita sanyasi bhakti tatva nahi jani maya vade bhashi locha janya mahaprabhu said i am a maya vadi in the renounced order of life and i do not even know what transcendental loving service to the lord is i simply float in the ocean of mayavad philosophy sarvabhoma sange moramana nirmala haile krishna bhakti tatvaka tanhari puchil due to association of sarvabhoma bhata charya my mind has been enlightened therefore i have asked sarvabhoma bhata charya about the truths of transcendental loving service to krishna then ho ka he ami nahi jane krishna katha sabe ramananda jane then ho nahi eta sarva bhoma bata acharya told me I do not actually know about the topics of Lord Krishna. They are all known only to Ramananda Roy. But he is not present here. Tumara thani ailana tumara mahima suniya tumi more stuti kara sanyasi janiya lotri chitana mahaprabhu continued after hearing about your glories i have come to your place however you are offering me words of praise out of respect for sanyasi one in the renounced order of life t 
Kipa Vipra Kipa Nyasi Sutra Kenanaya Ye Krishna Tatra Veta Se Guru Paya Whether one is a Brahmana, a Sanyasi, or a Sutra, regardless of what he is, he can become a spiritual master if he knows the science of Krishna. Text 129. Sanyasi Bahalya More Na Kariya Vanjana Krishna Radha Tatvakahi Puna Karamana. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu continued. Please do not try to treat me thinking of me as a learned sannyasi. Please satisfy my mind by just describing the truths of Radha and Krishna. Yadyapi Roy, Premi Mahabhagavati, Tandra Mana Krishna Maya, Nari Acha Titan, the Tapi Prabhura Icha Parama Prabhala, Janjale Prayera Mana Hila Kalamala. Sri Ramananda Roy was a great devotee of the Lord and a lover of God. And although his mind could not be covered by Krishna's illusory energy, and although he could understand the mind of the Lord, which was very strong and intense, Ramananda's mind became a little agitated. Wow. But we can think more higher than this, this what you understand. <laughs> so your salute and salute should be what Prabhupada said. We have to track that. I have when it's perfection come in Sarup Sarup Siddhi, then we have to discuss. That's it, that's So why he writes Sarup and Sarup Siddhi? Because if you want to be understand Krishna, what is the line? What is the line? Um, and although he could not understand the mind of the Lord, which was very strong and intense, Ramananda's mind became a little agitated. Yeah. Now I have come to understand the sublime goal of life. Yeah, uh, sublime this. goal of life. And the process of achieving it. Achieving. Through Raj Bhakti, loving and change. 
and for that i have to fit my spiritual form that's it by devotional practice to fix it <laughs> if i not do devotion from my hand to radha mohan not possible guru is not a goal radha mohan is the goal <coughs> then we need sarup that is my homework and develop perfection in yours this moment what prabhu pad right in page 4 sarup and sarup siddhi by devotional practice this to achieve information gathering is no meaningful after this achievement mahaprabhu open the door then try to listen and understand that's it so please Oh yeah. <laughs> Understand? <clears throat> Damoda. You are my preacher also in Russia. Yeah. Scary. Yeah. Scary. Yeah. Z- yeah. Z- yeah. Z- yeah. Z- you. <laughs> And when you will change as I bow. I will slap you. Okay. A sai bhav in sarup and sarup siddhi not my word prabhu pad <laughs> i know say my word narayan maharaj word <laughs> prabhu pad i am the student small baby of them nothing there you have to achieve and he is your friend you have to care him he need your association both work together 